New this morning, smoke and flames take over a home in Huber Heights, forcing a mom and her two young children to escape. At first, there were reports of someone trapped inside this home and multiple crews were called out. It happened just before three this morning and our Amber Watson is right there on scene now on Charlesworth Drive and tells us what investigators may now have a cause for this fire. Good morning, Amber. That's right. Good morning. I just recently talked to the battalion chief and he tells me that unattended cooking may have started the fire this morning and fire crews are still out here on the scene and going in and out of that house just to make sure that this fire is still completely out this morning. And when firefighters were called to this house just before 3.30, they saw heavy smoke and some flames coming from the house. Now, mother and her two small children had already escaped. And this morning I talked to a next door neighbor as she was caring for one of the small children in that fire. And she tells me that the mother ran to her house screaming to call 911. At first, there was some confusion that that grandmother may still be in the house. The mother indicated that she was confident that her mother was trapped inside the house. So immediately additional resources were called. Uh, fortunately, I'm, I'm glad to report when we searched the home, it came up negative. We found nobody. They have contacted that grandmother. She is okay this morning. And the battalion chief just believes that woman was confused from all the commotion. Now, when crews got to the house, they did hear smoke detectors going off and found heavy flames in the kitchen. And that fire was quickly spreading to the attic. Now, they were able to contain that fire to that area. And the battalion chief tells me the mother and her two and three year old suffered minor smoke inhalation. All three were taken to the hospital to be evaluated. And due to the damage, the family will not be able to go back into the house right away. Way. And the chief says that they will likely stay with relatives in the area. And this morning, the battalion chief is stressing the importance of having a working smoke detector inside your home. And he says that's what likely helped that family escape this morning. But coming up in the next half hour, you'll hear from that neighbor and why she tells us she believes it was something else that woke up that mother. For now, reporting live in Huber Heights, Amber Watson, ABC 22 News.